Good morning, Monza TV. This is Jay Creel coming at you from Monza World Class Karting. Today we have a really unique opportunity as we have the Real Man Show producers along with Chris Tyrrell from Monza World Class Karting here. And we're actually doing a TV program that will be distributed on the internet in conjunction with the Real Man Show, Silent Partner Marketing, and Vet TV. So we're really excited to have these guys down here and we're looking forward to seeing how fast they can go today here on our World Class Circuit. Kyle Reyes from Silent Partner Marketing. We're filming the Real Man Show today. What do you think of mine so far? Well, I think that you guys have no idea what's coming because I'm sort of the ringer of it. I know nobody wants to really talk about that, but I get pulled over regularly. Uh, sort of a speed demon. So what I would tell Kyle is use those downhills to your advantage. Oh, please. This whole thing better be downhill. I'm totally screwed. But no, man, this is a spectacular experience. This, this track is gorgeous. The crew here, second to none, man. I'm so excited to go smoke some of these guys out there. here with Russ Rocknack from Mesh New England Magazine. He's here doing the Real Man Show with us today. What do you think of this event? Oh, this is fantastic, Jay. What a wonderful opportunity to get out and um, run the track with some uh, other individuals that have the need for speed. So Russ is here representing the Dream Ride. He came down with Dean Cassano from Motor Cars Incorporated and Bryce Atkis from ACI Dynamics, some of our partners here at Monza World Class Karting. And they're representing Dream Ride in the Special Olympics today. Tell us about that initiative and, and your involvement. Oh, it's a wonderful event, and it happens in um, happens in August in Farmington, Connecticut, and it draws thousands of individuals. Last year, for the show itself, we had over just about a thousand cars on the field. For the Dream Ride itself, we had over 400 cars in one consecutive ride, all giving Special Olympians rides in exotic cars from Pagani's to Model A's. So, to see smiles on faces and to make a difference at what we're here for. Um, and to pass that on, it's all good karma. So last year was our first year at Monza to participate in Dream Ride. It was an incredible experience. We weathered some uh, pretty horrific weather at first, uh, yeah. but it turned out to be a beautiful afternoon for the crews, for the athletes, and for all the uh, special folks that participated in that. We're looking forward to being a part of it again. We appreciate you being here today and look forward to seeing Monza at the Dream Ride this coming August at the Farmington Polo Grounds. from the Real Man Show. We're doing a track walk. Santino Ferrucci is teaching them all the fine points of the Monza World Class Karting Circuit. We're really excited to have Santino show them how to get around this track fast. And we're looking forward to seeing whether or not they can take anything they're learning from Santino and apply it to the actual karting. Santino's really doing a great job with this track walk for the Real Man Show participants. We have them here at the top of all the She's talking about the apex. What do you think about this event so far? The guys from the Real Man Show here. Santino giving some real Oh, really good cool. tech tips. Well, Santino has a lot of laps around here so far, so he's pointing out all the bumps and uh, you know all the, all the tricks to the guy. So it's pretty neat. We'll, we'll wait and see when they get on the track how uh, if they listen to what he said. So let's see if these guys take any of this information and they apply it to their karting. We'll see what happens when they come down this hill for the first time yeah. and they feel that bump as they're trying to turn the cart. So Kyle Reyes and Mike Monaco just had their first laps here at Monza World Class Karting as part of the Real Man Show. What'd you guys think? You know, so here I am cruising along at about 60 and change and I see this little old lady strolling down and then I realize, no, it's not. It's Mike Monaco. <laughs> Otherwise, <laughs> Yeah, it was an awesome time, man. The track's great. Uh, it's cool after a few laps really figuring out the lines and stuff and where to lift and where to break. So definitely an educational experience. We're having a great time.
We have the cast of The Real Man Show along with Donnie O'Malley from Vet TV. They just ran a couple of heats out here at Monza World Class Karting and we're here to talk about what The Real Man Show is all about and what Vet TV is and what brought them here to Monza today. So we introduced Kyle Reyes. Kyle, tell me, tell me about The Real Man Show and how it all started. So first of all, brother, this is not your grandmother's go-kart track. This thing was insane. You know, the whole idea of The Real Man Show is that we can embrace who we are as men filled with honor and integrity and dignity and respect, but still go out there and embrace that manliness and have a good time. And man, we, we embraced it and we had a hell of a time today. So Mike Monaco's here from Monaco Ford. He's a big part of the show, cast of characters these two are. So what are your thoughts? And tell me how you got involved with, uh, with Kyle. So it was more or less over, uh, I think it was a glass of whiskey, yeah. maybe a shot or two. Uh, Kyle came to me and said, hey, what are we going to do to get, get you out of the office? We start working with some other people and bringing some advertising in. So uh, we made the decision to start The Real Man Show. Uh, we wanted it to be about honor and integrity, like you said, uh, being respectful um, and being with like-minded people. So you guys uh, having us today was exactly what the show is all about, and we appreciate everything you've done for us today. Well, we at Mons are really privileged to have these guys here. We're privileged to be a part of The Real Man Show. Uh, we're very grateful for folks like Donnie and his boys uh, coming over with Vet TV. We uh, are privileged for your service and happy to have you here. Tell us about Vet TV and how that uh, originated. Uh, so Vet TV was started out of a need to create comedy and entertainment for veterans, uh, specifically post 9-11. That was like the group that we started for. Um, but then we have grown into something for all generations. And um, we create comedy that recreates the military experience because it's important for us to like relive those memories in a positive way and um, connect us together. Well, we're really grateful to have you guys here. We're grateful for your service. We thank you all and all your boys that came down and had a good time. We definitely agree it's not your grandmother's go-kart go track, and we're happy to have you guys back at any point. So thanks for coming down. We appreciate it. Can I, can I add something here? Uh, I thought this was like some kitty go-kart racing thing when I showed up, and then I'm <laughs> getting I'm, I'm getting warned by, uh, what, uh, what's the Italian racer? The, by the professional Italian <laughs> Formula F1 racer about every little inch of this track and how we need to be aware of the, the tenth of a second that we can add to our ride and I'm just getting nervous out of my mind. Anxiety ridden. It's, it's over now. You just have. To I've been to afraid for my life this <laughs> entire morning. Thank you guys for this. I'm the biggest fraud to ever hit the Real Man Show. <laughs> Appreciate that, guys. Well, thanks for tuning in to Monza TV. We're looking forward to seeing what The Real Man Show has to bring in the next several episodes. And uh, thanks for tuning in.